Hey guys, I'm Mikey, my back here for another video. Guys, real fast before I begin this video, I talked about this in a separate video, but pretty much I did open up my own merch shop. Again, it is just for people who want to go ahead and help support the channel and get some cool actual merch. It is it's just out there for anyone who wants it. I know some people don't like designs. Some people do. So if you do, you do like designs, go ahead and check them out. But this is pretty much what it is. Again, it all is up to you if you want to go ahead and buy anything. It would help support the channel and you can rock some uh, that Muck Gamer merch. Nonetheless, guys, let's get right into it. So Guru said on a live stream, plain and simple, there's a new power-up system coming out this upcoming Friday. So this upcoming Friday, there will be a new power-up system for certain players. Now, he only he only expressed one player in the live stream, but I'm guessing that there probably will be more than one player, probably multiple players, and this will probably be a new system in Mutt 19. Now, what is this system? Well, guys, this system is Mutt 18 in Mutt 19. No joke. This is going to be the same exact setup as Mutt 18 and Mutt 19. So, for example, what you're going to have to go ahead and do is you're going to have to, let's say, the guy that he talked about was Patrick Mahomes. Now, Patrick Mahomes currently just got a 90 overall Team of the Week card. Now, his Team of the Week master currently, as you're going to see, has gone, I think, going up a little bit in value because he is going ahead and getting a new power-up with that Team of the Week master. So, let's go ahead and see how much he's actually going for on the auction block. He's going for 350000 315,000 coins. Now, this 90 overall power up or this 90 overall Patrick Mahomes cannot be powered up. You look at the left hand corner, you go, wow, he can't be powered up. Well, even though he can't be powered up, there is a new power up set coming this Friday. What this is going to go ahead and take is you need his base elite, his rising star. So, obviously, he's rising star, I believe, last week, and his 90 overall team of the week master to give you back a 91 overall Patrick Mahomes. So even though this card right here cannot be powered up, cannot have an ability added to him, he will be able to be added an ability this upcoming Friday. This upcoming Friday, you will be able to power up Patrick Mahomes. Now I'm guessing how EA is going to work this is they're probably going to be doing this with all the players that do not have power-ups at the moment. So for example, you know, if we're going through the list of quarterbacks right here, obviously you can see all these players do have power-ups, which key tip, if you want to know what players have power-ups, that little icon in the left-hand corner go ahead and tells you that player can be powered up. But if we go to the list, there's a lot of players that can't be powered up. Emmanuel Sanders is a good example. So, for example, if they do do this with every single team, when they choose one player from every single team that can't be powered up and give them a power-up, it will raise the prices of those said players. So, for example, if they do Emmanuel Sanders, you would need his um, what 87 overall veterans card and his 90 overall uh, card right here. Now, for Patrick Mahomes, I think I messed up. I don't think he has a base elite, but that's a good example if the card did have a base elite. You would most likely need everything in that set. Now, Guru did not tell us everything that's going into that set. He just told us the top things as the rising star for Mr. Um, Patrick Mahomes and the 90 overall card. But what we can assume is most likely most of the cards that will get power-ups will most likely need that actual card added in order to go ahead and power them up to the max ability. So, for example, if we're going through each single team, you could probably take a guess that, you know, certain players like Randall Cobb, depending on, you know, what the highest overall card is for their, uh, you know, player, might get a new power-up card. Now, Randall Cobb might not because his best card is only an 85. He could. It's perfectly, you know, logical. He does have two different cards, so he could get a power-up. But, again, we it's all just a guessing game, right? We have no idea at the moment anything about this promo or any or not promo anything about the set and this you know new thing added to the game but definitely tell me down below your thoughts and opinions what do you guys think of this are you excited about it are you not excited who do you think should get a new power-up card um it's a really cool to be added to the game something you know brand new added to the game again this is kind of like my 18 and my 19 with the fact that this is going to be like you know cards that don't have power-ups are kind of following that same philosophy as last year it looks like again i have no way of knowing exactly what goes in the set guru even said he's gonna keep that all in the vault until friday um uh, but this friday guys this should be a really great fantastic uh you know news update and we should be able to see something really cool so again if they do all 32 teams which this probably will happen just because the fact that you know if they're already doing this one player why not continue with every team and kind of give every team an actual player to power up but 
For example, Andy Dalton might get a, you know, another card. He might get a power-up card. We can go ahead and get him up to an 85. Now, the one thing I know why they're doing this, and it makes so much sense, and I love it so much, is because of the fact that they're doing this, obviously, because Patrick Mahomes is a 90 overall and cannot get an ability. And certain players will say that have fantastic, you know, year, like Patrick Mahomes is currently, if they can't get an ability, it kind of makes the card a little bit useless. Not completely, but it really diminishes the value of the card. Now, if they can get an ability, it adds value to the card, which, of course, the power-up new power-up system will help, and it will make these cards more sought after. So, for example, Patrick Mahomes, once he can go ahead and get Conductor, I don't I, I did not look at his stats compared to the actual, you know, what unlocks certain abilities. But he can get an ability once he goes ahead and, of course, gets, um, you know, the power-up set. So, again, guys, just wanted to break this down for you. Wanted to tell you guys exactly what, how this works and kind of give you the rundown of what we can expect Friday. Friday should be a huge day when it comes to this stuff. Um, again, we are just know at this moment of Patrick Mahomes, but we are assuming that there will be more than just Patrick Mahomes power-up set-wise. Uh, and who knows, maybe they'll do a new weekly promo where they add one player a week with the new power-up set. Thank you guys for watching. Peace out.